almost 300 missed fast from the 22 years that I was not practicing Islam. May I fast every Monday and Thursday with a double intention. Um, number one, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive you and congratulations for recognizing that you are lacking behind, recognizing your duties towards Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala before it is too late. This is one of the greatest na'mah, if not the greatest na'mah ever, uh, to come back to your senses before death and to repent and to start practicing again. Some of the scholars said if a person was not praying for years, then he was out of the folds of Islam, even if he was born in Islam. Accordingly, they would not ask him to make up the missed prayers, missed fasting, or anything because he was not actually considered to be Muslim. Others say, uh, well, he was lazy, so when he repented, he is still a Muslim, but he will be required to make up the missed prayers and fasting and zakah and so on. So if you choose to make up those days, like uh, if you were praying but you are not fasting, then you must make up the days of uh, the missed fasting because you are already praying. So fasting on Mondays and Thursdays would give you the reward of making up and hopefully it would give you the reward of consigning the sunnah of fasting on those days. But you cannot have uh, uh, an overlapping intentions like fasting for a sunnah and fasting for uh, a fard because making up the missed fasting is a fard. So you cannot, but making, the, making up the missed fasting on those days, you may be rewarded for coinciding the preferable days for fasting as the Nabi وسلم, used to fast on those days. But I should not intend this is fard and sunnah meanwhile. There is no overlapping.